All right, so I'm sitting outside. I'm outside right now, and it's the middle of the daytime. This is a great, 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 great day to be sitting outside. You know, hopefully I don't get too distracted by squirrels that's running around here. It's a squirrel up in a tree, and it's I got a little ADD. I may get jumping around a little bit. <laughs> but look, today we're going to talk about, of course, that talking about get focused. All right, so we're going to talk about getting focused. You know, we in the last episode, we were talking about, uh, it was a follow-up to, to get self-confidence. We followed that up with getting momentum, all right, the big mo. So today, we the natural progression is once we've started taking some action, it's time for us to start focusing in on what it is that we want to get to what we want to do. Now, I want to tell you a story. The first time I heard this, uh, the word focus in an acronym, it was uh, early, it was like 6, 7 o'clock in the morning. Uh, I was working with this company, and every morning what he would, the, the leadership on this company would have a call. And on this call, we discussed different books he wanted us to, um, to read and just different topics. And at the end of the call, he'd actually go through a whole bunch of affirmations, and we'd all do our little chants or whatnot at the end of it. Uh, it, was, it was real cool. But one time, one thing I heard on this call, one of the things I heard on this call was the word focus broken down as this. Focus standing for... <laughs> as I look up, <laughs> focus standing for follow one course until successful. Now, what does that really mean? You know, follow one course until successful. It's almost self-explanatory, but I want to break it down a little more to you. Okay? See, when I here's another example for you. When I was in uh, learning how to play an instrument, okay, I'm I'm using instruments as this example because I believe most people either play an instrument and know someone who plays an instrument or just know a little bit about, about understand the process about how to become good at, it, at um, playing an instrument. Okay, so here it is. What we ended up doing is first we started off, we, we got our instrument and we focused on the only thing we had to do was learn how to put the, I played the saxophone, put the reed on the mouthpiece, put the mouthpiece on, put the uh, instrument together, and play the basic notes. Here's an A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Uh, e, F, G. And this one all the way, all the way up, okay? A, B, C, D, E, F. <laughs> all right, we went through all those, uh, the notes, right? But then after that, the only thing we were able to focus on was A chord. We just focused on one chord at a time. Now, as we've learned that, like the first chord I believe I learned was C. So I learned all the different notes that go on in the C chord, okay? Once I learned all those notes, then I was able to bring in the next chord, okay? And then A, and then whatever it is, the D minor, and all these different chords. I learned all these different chords as I progressed. But first, I had to focus on this one chord. And you know what happened? As I, because I learned and focused on that one chord, the next chord was that much easier for me to understand because I already had a good solid foundation. So I could start from that one chord and branch out. And eventually I'm able to make up my own music because I understood the chords and progression and what notes would be in tune with each other. Okay, and start playing around with it. Same thing comes along when I really start taking action. All right, you're gonna focus on one major thing because we've taken this major action. That's good. Okay, we got the momentum going. Okay, so we're still going on here, right? <laughs> we this show, the show must go on, right? So, as you continue to move forward with your business, you have to focus on focus narrow down before you start expanding back out, because it's just, it's not very smart, and you know it yourself to be uh, what is it? What does the saying go? Okay, you've heard to be a jack of all trades and master of what? None. So when you follow one course until successful. Now, those last two words are very, 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 very important. Until. Again, there goes that word resolve. Doing it until, meaning that I'm not giving up. Successful. You have to decide, define success for yourself. That's part of the things we're going to gonna talk about tomorrow. How do we decide, define success for yourself? Okay? So, we have done our prayer. We did our spiritual cleansing. See? Squirrel. I told you it was going to happen. <laughs> we, we had prayer. Then we went to a spiritual cleansing. Then we moved on to uh, taking action through the course of getting self-confidence, which also leads to getting some more momentum. And now we got to get focused. Okay? We got 
get to got to get focused. And from here, we follow that one course until successful. Tomorrow, the next episode, we're going to talk about success. But for right now, we're going to file this this little message here under the gnats and everything else out here. But it's the midday. Who cares? I can do what I want to do out here in the middle of the day. The pool is shut down over here. No kids around here. So it means the kids got to be are back to school and focused on their books, hopefully. School about time let out right now. I mean, there's a guy over here, uh, uh, over here in the pool, in the lake behind me, the creek, whatever it is behind me. He's back out there fishing, you know. I'm actually having fun. Filming squirrels. <laughs> anyway, so we got to get focused and we'll talk about success in the next episode. Okay, so we're going to file this on a storytellingoverselling.com forward slash get focused. Storytelling Overselling dot com forward slash get focus. All right, so if you like what we talked about here today, you like what we've been talking about in these episodes, be sure to go ahead and subscribe to this YouTube channel. All right, and if you found some value in what we just discussed today, even in, even in finding the seeing the squirrels here today and talking about getting distracted, you can take it as a, as a way to. Oh, see, there goes another one right there. You think I'm playing? Look at that. Just came running out of here. <laughs> you think I was playing? I wasn't playing by the squirrels, man. <laughs> that is too funny. Anyway, storytellingoverselling.com forward slash get focused. Be sure to like and share this if you like what's going on. Talk to you later. Love you.